Good morning, this is Bob. Beautiful morning here in southern Michigan. Uh, been out and took a three mile walk. I think that's one of the best things a person can do for their health is to get out there and take a nice long walk. Get that heart moving, get the blood pumping anyhow. Really enjoyed that this morning. Just came in from outside. It's 10 o'clock in the morning here. I have been interested in a little radio called the Paraset. This was a little radio used in World War II. It was dropped uh, behind enemy lines in France uh, in World War II and the, uh, the uh, resistance movement in France used it to communicate with the, uh, with the uh, uh, MI6, I believe it was, uh, in, uh, in England. So uh, they made thousands of these. Anyhow, it's a fascinating little radio, and I thought I'd build one up, and maybe on the cold winter nights this winter I can get on the air and, uh, and uh, see how this thing works. So anyhow, I've been acquiring parts and looking to see what I had in the junk here. Uh, most of these I had already in the junk box. I got a hinge at the hardware store and a hasp. I did buy an original knob. It's even got the drive disc on the back of it already. It came in the original box. I bought that on eBay. That was kind of expensive, but it came with postage paid and everything. And uh, I sure do like eBay. It's a regular virtual ham fest on the internet. You buy all kinds of things there. And uh, you don't have to go running around and use gasoline and all that in all your time. You just look at what you want. You buy it. Uh, if you have an account with uh, PayPal, you pay for it right then. Uh, this is the wood I used for the box. It's a it's an old shelf made of quarter inch cabinet grade plywood. It has four plies and I used some very very thin brads and nailed it together and I also glued it. I made it as one piece like that and then I took a uh, saber saw and uh, cut it in half. I cut the pieces for it with a big circular saw like you use when you're doing construction in a house big electric circular saw handheld uh, does not do the very best job for cutting uh, something like this but I don't have a table saw so that's what I used I used what I have and it came out pretty good uh, it does have a lot of spots around on here that had uh, they had holes in the shelf so I'm going to uh, just paint it gray because I filled those with wood filler and I don't think it would look good if it was varnished so I'm going to just paint it with some gray paint and uh, so that's it just getting started on this project and I just wanted to uh, make a first segment here on the construction of the uh, Mark 7 World War II Paraset sometimes called a spy radio that's it fellas 73's and good DX